Okay, in this video tutorial, I'm going to explain SIRs and how to simplify them. A SIRD is any square root of a number which is not a perfect square. Now, perfect squares include the numbers 1, 4, 9, 16, 25, 36, 49, 64, 81, and 100. Now, the reason these are perfect squares is because the square root of each of these numbers is a whole number. So, for example, the square root of 4 equals 2, because 2 squared, i.e. 2 times 2, equals 4. So that's not, so that is a perfect square, because its square root equals a whole number. However, the square root of 5 is not a whole number, because its result is a decimal. So the square root of 5 equals 2.23606 and so on. It's not a whole number and thus it's not a perfect square so f the square root of 5 is a third and the square root of 4 is not a third. Now, now I'm going to show you how to simplify thirds which is fairly easy. It can be done just using two simple rules which go as follows. The square root of A times the square root of B equals the square root of AB. Now in practice it's a lot simpler than it looks. So all it's saying is the square root of 5 times the square root of 2 equals the square root of 5 times 2 which equals the square root of 10. There, that simplified it easy. Now, simplifying thirds which are dividing is just as simple and it's a very similar rule. The square root of A over the square root of B equals the square root all of A over B. In practice, that means the square root of 10 over the square root of 5 equals the square root all of 10 over 5, which equals the square root of 2. Okay, hence 10 divided by 5 is 2. And it's as easy as that. I hope you've enjoyed this video tutorial, and if you've got any requests on anything mathematics, physics, or chemistry related, then please message me, um, and do like and subscribe to my channel, and if you've got any questions, just post them in the comments.